Wow, this impressive question given our three congruent squares and the length of this red and purple line segment as 10 and 8 centimeter. Exciting part is with this limited data, we have to find area of each of these squares. Okay, let's check the solution. We'll solve it in two steps. First step, we'll find value of this angle A here and then we'll find area of square. Let's start by assuming the side length of square as x centimeter and let's draw this uh, diagonals of the square that's BO, CO and AO. We know that diagonal length is root 2 times of side length so this will be root 2x, root 2x and root 2x. Now if you look carefully this point A, B, C they are equidistant from this center O. So O is the circumcenter of this triangle ABC or we can draw a circle with center O and radius root 2x. Now in a square diagonal and the side length they make an angle of 45 degrees and thus this angle also is 45 degrees. Now in this circle let's apply inscribed angle theorem that is this chord BC is making an angle of 90 degree at the center of circle and by theorem it will make half of that in the remaining part of the circumference. So this angle here will be 45 degrees. Now for the second part that is area of this squares let's consider this triangle ABC and apply sin cosine law in it. Cosine law states that a square is b square plus c square minus 2bc cos theta where abc these are the side lengths of the triangle theta is angle between side b and c so here putting the values a square that's your 2x b is your 8 and c is 10 theta is 45 degrees Solving it, so LHS this will be 4x square is 64 plus 100 minus 160 times of cos 45 is 1 root 2. Simplifying it further, 4x square is 164 minus 80 root 2 and x square that will be 41 minus 20 root 2. And x square is what is area of this blue square which we had to find and thus area of square in decimal that will be 12.72 centimeter square and that's our answer. I hope you enjoyed the solution. I will see you in next video. Till then, tata, bye bye.